Hello everybody, in this video demo, I would like to show how you can bring 2D Rhino curves into Photoshop for further illustration purposes. Okay, let's start. As you can see on screen, I have created 2D curves that were traced from an image that was uh, brought in via the picture frame command. Okay, if you would like to know the process of uh, tracing using this method, you might want to click on the card over here to go to a previous video. Okay, okay let's proceed. Okay, um, what I want to do is to export only the relevant curves to Photoshop. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to hide the stuff that will not be brought into Photoshop. Okay, so these are the stuff that we will bring into Photoshop and I will uh, select them and then go to File, Export Selected and save as a PDF format. Okay, so um, I'm going to save as 2D uh, Export 1 PDF. Okay, and click Save. Okay, and okay. Um, there are a few parameters that you might want to take note. Firstly, is the size of your image. Okay, and then the next thing is actually the view and output scale. So, uh, you should set it to extend so that the the two D curves are are scaled to the border of the of the image okay so you can click ok and now uh, let's go to Photoshop and go to file open to open up the image okay save as 2d export one okay and let's click open okay and you might want to set your resolution and click ok okay so we brought in the curves and you zoom in You'll be able to see the curves, okay? So um, the kind of work that uh, you will need um, basically is to um, leave the layer one intact without making any modifications, and uh, but to do a subsequent work on the layers above it, okay? Let me just do a, a fast uh, uh, demo. Okay, basically you only use the layer one for selections of uh, regions where colors need to be filled okay so uh, for example um, if I want to fill this entire region I can select here and do uh, inverse selection and but then I go to the layer uh, above it to do my work okay for example let's see Let's uh, change it to this, okay? Yeah, so so we're actually doing that this type of work uh, on the layers uh, above the, the layer one. And yeah, so in a nutshell, you might have to build a lot of layers above it, okay? See you around. Bye.